Well, hi everyone. Good evening, hoodlums. Thank you for joining me again for another stream, another day. And as sometimes happens on Mondays, when they roll around, for me at least anyway, uh, I'm trying a new game. A new game for me, not a new game as in it just got released. New game for me. Wait, boy, come back. Come here, boy. I know, I gotta do the intro first, boy. And then you shall be rewarded. My Bubsy. No, that's not good. There we go. Mm -hmm. All right, just, all right. Here's one for waiting like a good boy. Can I have one paw? Oh, very nice. There you go. Okay. Now give me just a few more minutes. Hello, hello, hello. Thank you all for being here. Let me get caught up on the chat. Rodna, hello. Thank you for being here. I'm doing wonderfully. So is Mr. Wellington. This boy's had a nice day. We got rained out of our second walk, which was a little bit sad. Um, but we still had some good exercise, some good play, and a lot of fun. A lot of excitement still. And he has had his big dinner, but as you guys know, sometimes after dinner, he gets a big burst of energy. And he also acts like I, like, absolutely should have to share my meal with him like no matter I, I almost always feed him before myself right like thinking like I don't want him to sit there and watch me eat and be hungry and not know why I'm not giving him any food but I just gave him a giant bowl of food like a giant like well not giant but it's gourmet all right it's a properly portioned bowl of food but it looks just it's like gourmet right and this boy and like boy you act like I don't feed you but he is being a good boy and has been a good boy but now that he wants this squeaky bone who knows who knows everyone say for two thank you for being here the chat warmer uppers indeed loco thank you so much for the hype I kind of love that the little hippo is doing the praise the sun like that's kind of amazing right oh, this feels so good He's actually doing the, uh, you know, the active uh, version of praising the sun. But in this case, praising the moon. Because as you guys can see, the name of this game is Moonlighter. And it's, oh. If you just read it off of paper, you're like, oh, this is a game I'm going to love. Now, I have only played it enough to basically set it up and make sure that it that it worked, um, but immediate first impressions, pretty good. So I'm excited to get further than five minutes in this game. I hope that you guys are too. Oh lord, red, red. Who did red? Okay, first is Pixie. Thank you for your membership. I appreciate that. 17 months. Who knows? It could be like 30, all right? The months are almost never right. But however many months it is, uh, Pixie, thank you very much. Now, Jay, to just be stressed, happy Monday, hoodlums. You have no idea how appropriate that is, Jay. Thank you. Oh, my God. Wow. Thank you, Jay. You are so just kind, supportive, and generous. Thank you. It's really amazing. And now you get awkward, Jess. Too Jess to be stressed. I like that. I like that. I was a little stressed today. I was a little stressed getting set up today. I'm not gonna lie. But I got this boy. I got a new game. I got my hoodlums. And the stream is running smoothly. I really can't ask for much more, okay? Right? That's how I feel. Praising the sun. I'm going to praise the sun as soon as this boy lets go so I can fetch it. Or I decide to just let him have it. Do you want me to fetch you, boy? Hmm? I saw Mia slap, slap with a tortilla. <laughs> Listen. Mia, pretty much in anything that has, I've ever done with when it comes to those things Mia Mia's chops hurt the worst 
Mia's tortilla slaps weren't fun. Not that I have anyone else's tortilla slaps to compare to. Do you hear this boy? But listen, she got she got some like oomph behind what she does, okay? And it does translate because people are like like they are, and I'm like, yep, yep. Sometimes you can get that, and it's like, eh, it wasn't too bad. It was okay. It was fine. It's totally fine. 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 Stephanie, thank you so much for your membership. Cool game. I hope so. Now, this game has been out since 2018, and um, as I said before, if you read the description off of a piece of paper, you'd be like, oh, this is definitely a game I'm gonna love. You run a shop by day. You're like a little shopkeeper, right? In And you sell gems and, you know, various other assorted, you know, uh, items, right? But by night, you go into the dungeons and you adventure and explore. And you do it to collect and find and acquire, you know, things, right, to sell in your shop. But it's like, not just only the most powerful relics are valuable, like everything, you're selling everything that you can from the dungeons. So I'm very excited. The, uh, I found it looking for games like Stardew Valley, and I read a thing saying, like, it kind of, <laughs> it's kind of like, kind of, in a sense, the way, like, Stardew Valley is if you ran a shop during the day, but it, um, it, it or instead of farming during the day, what you did is running, is run a shop, because in, Har in Stardew Valley, it was kind of the same thing, like, you had to spend a certain amount of time like working your farm and then a certain amount of time in the dungeons. And this, you have to spend a certain amount of time in your shop and then you go to the dungeons. But you improve the shop experience, right? The more dungeon stuff and I'm, I'm very excited about it. I am shamed. Why? Oh, cause you, th don't, don't shame yourself over a typo. Typos happen. Some of the funniest things ever are thanks to typos, Jay. I'm glad everyone enjoyed the tortilla video. It was, it, when we were done, I was like, that is like the stupidest thing I've ever done, but I think it will be really funny. So it was worth it. Boy! We went on, I know, I, yeah. It went on and on. Basically, we looked at each other and it was like this agreement of like, like, no, no, nope. We're, you're gonna have to keep going. Like, I'm gonna do this. Or we're gonna run out of tortillas, okay? Which we were dangerously close to doing, by the way. Exploded. They really did. Yes, Morgan, the tortillas got wrecked fast. Indeed. Robert, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Well, here, boy. Take it. Fine. Please, everyone, as Robert is saying, and I appreciate you using your, your, your monthly message, Robert, to remind everyone to please like the video if you haven't done that yet. It's completely free takes just a second to do it and it's a huge help to my channel to this video in particular but also to my entire channel uh, and thus my career on YouTube so if you could do that that'd be great and, you know maybe check and make sure you're subscribed sometimes you think you're subscribed and you're not I've done that so many times so many times so just double check make sure and because there's a lot of people watching me that aren't subscribed like a higher number than it should be. And I am convinced it's just, they actually think they're subscribed, but they're not. So, so just start it out there. If you're watching, just double check, you know. And, uh, and of course, all the hoodlums in the chat room. Thank you guys. Keeping the lagoon a, a nice, chill, fun, relaxed place to be. It's not, it's not a crazy place, right? It's not, a lagoon is not crazy. It's relaxed. It's chill. It's got different corners with different, you know, different things happening in it at different times. But overall, it's a very relaxing and comfortable environment, which is what I want. It's really nice to be able to do something like this, socialize like this for extended periods of time and have it be like rewarding and not draining like most socializing is for me. So thank you guys for being a part of that. All right. You keep watching it. Amazing, amazing, Grin and Ferret. I love it. 
I'm glad people enjoy it. It was really dumb, but it was it was just also very funny. And Orson just makes it. He's so perfect in it. Like, I don't know. He was so perfect. He was so perfect. <laughs> Boy. Be nice, please. Everyone's watching you, boy. They're gonna judge you. No. But be nice. Be nice. Be nice. Very good. Now lay down. Bubsy. A package should have been delivered. Oh my god, I did have packages. I didn't open them. I will check them. I will check them, Queens, on the break. If anyone else is interested, I do have an Amazon wish list. Thank you, Queens, for letting everyone know. The link is in the description. That's also, you know, a completely okay way to support the stream and me and Mr. Wellington, if you so choose. Absolutely, like, not necessary. In fact, I put things on that list as like a checklist for myself for things to get that as I, you know, am able to get them or if I do have the funds, I get it. I get, I get what I want, but you can't get everything at once. Right? So sometimes it's just planned in advance, but there's a lot of things that I know and I like being able to, uh, I like being able to take good care of this boy, you know, I really do and myself. So hence why there's things like the bulletproof on there. It's just, I get it when I can, but there's, you know, there's some months where it's just like, it ain't happening. So it's really nice and I really appreciate it when you guys use that. So thank you. It's in the description. That's where I put all the useful links. If ever they are not working or you go into the description and it's not like a good experience, please let me know either in the chat room or in the comments. The comment section is open. The chat room, obviously you guys, you know, that's like the perk, right, of membership, to get the chat room. But the comment section is open, and I, I don't want the people that are watching that are not subscribed to not feel like they're a part of the community or like they don't have a voice. Like, please, you absolutely do. I love reading the comments. I do my very, very best to, to read them, and if I look at them, I make sure that I put the little heart on them. Like, if I see it, I read it, I put that heart because I think it feels good to know that your comment was actually read. And that's, for me, that's what that means, okay? And I don't, listen, I don't get every single comment because I go back in usually about once a month and see all of the ones that happened on videos that weren't in my most recent videos because I don't get the same kind of notification for those. Um, so I do miss them sometimes, but I really do appreciate the feedback and the conversation and the, you know, the community that happens on the comment section as well. Boy. Boy. So yeah. Here we go. Sit, boy. Good boy. Boy, I, pl I'm playing with you, but then you don't want to, you don't want to, um, You don't want to let go. You just hang on to it and cry. Hmm? Jabba's, uh, if you mean by the lurkers, that's, you know, that's appropriate, I feel like, for the people that are watching, right? No one's talking to that little Jawa that's leaning out the side, but he's there and he's a part of things. So yeah, I know, squeaky, squeaky, squeak. I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to do my best and just get started. I think he's, he's gonna do that thing where he chews on it like an ear of corn, it's fine. All right, so this is Moonlighter, we're gonna play it. Hope you guys are ready. Uh, new, let's do new game, cause like, I, right there. I did not play 23 minutes. It was left open for 23 mi minutes maybe. But we're gonna start number one, number one new, Best new game. Um, where's my hold? Erase. It's going. It's gone. Erase it. Yes. It never happened. First try, never die. Right here. 
Oh my god, the purple, the purple cow. It's a cow, right? He loves it. He loves it. He took it to my brother's house today and had so much fun with it. Boy. Yes, it's, it's a big, it's a big win. It's a big win, Queens. Thank you for that. Queens sent him, and if he brings it over here. I saw him running around with it, but who knows where it's at now. Um, and he just absolutely loves it. It was sleeping on it. Oh, it's so cute. Uh, normal new game slot. Yeah, so there is, there's new game plus also, once you beat it, you beat the game. So it's just like Dark Souls. See? Now this, I love this. Hard. Recommended. Original difficulty level created by the developers. Recommended for most players. Absolutely. Like, for, for players who want a combat challenge, I think I'll be good. I, I think you save that for a second playthrough, you know? Oh my god. Boy. Alright, here's the story. I didn't realize the text was going. Okay. The dungeons were dangerous. So many lives were lost. The villagers didn't want to go into the dungeons anymore. Look, he's, he's like the last one of his family to run his shop. Will. His name is Will. Long dreaming of opening the mysterious fifth door of the dungeons. But he's an adventurer at heart, you see. I thought that like I heard voice. Did I imagine that earlier? That's what I was waiting on and then I didn't realize the text was going. Basically, Gears, I should have read it. I didn't realize it was going already. This very, uh, there was these, these, this very prosperous land and these people moved close to these dungeons and they became very rich from all of the spoils that they pulled from this dungeon. The whole town blew up from it, right? And then they, it's like the dwarves, like they got too greedy. People started dying and the town became kind of run down and dilapidated, you could say. And Will is the last of his family that runs his shop, the Moonlighter. Or is it, it is the Moonlighter. Um, that is his shop, all right? And here we are, little Will. Will is so tempted by the dungeons, though. He doesn't want, he doesn't, you know, he doesn't want to stop going into them, but everybody in the town's like, no, don't do it, it's dangerous. And he's like, oh, I want to. And so he is. And so that's where we're at right now. See your big backpack, but you're just a merchant. He does have a sick headband. What up, Cripsa? How are you? And see, so basically it's just like Dark Souls because you see roll and... And that's pretty much it. Okay. Yep. My tutorial is at the top, as you can see. I don't know if there's anything in those, but I want to break them. Yep, jump jump the gap, got it. So obviously this is the tutorial. Long jump, ah, yes, yes. Long jump, short jump, got it. Okay, this guy, oh, dodged past him, got it. Just like Dark Souls, got it. Oh, wait, I can just, hmm. All right, oop, oh, yes, 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 right. Oh, I about didn't do that, okay, yeah. Right, right. So basically what it's teaching you is dodging is very important. Ooh, give me that. Oh. Oh, I, oh yeah, my broom. So yeah, because I'm a shopkeeper, look at that, I got a broom. How cool is that? Ooh, ooh. Yeehaw! Listen. I'm pretty badass with a broom. Yeah. See this loot? This is loot I can sell in my store later. Or these health potions I can use, which I'm desperately gonna need. Yeah, Gears, I want to get rich. Uh-oh. Woo! Yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good with the, uh... Mm. Foundry rests fabric. Just quick move all. Yep, I'm gonna take all that. Thank you. 
So I don't move. There it is. Okay, I have to hold long press to move it. Cause I think Oh, I was like, I thought that was a hot bar. Maybe it's not. Alright, oh wait, other one. Yeah. Koozie! I didn't even see you come in. And now you're leaving. Goodbye, Koozie. Isn't it nighttime? Isn't now your time? Quick move. Nighttime is his time. Oops. Okay, wait. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh, they're bad. Oh no. Come on, I can do better than that. No, 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 no. Dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, this is this is stupid. This is this is not fair. Okay, yeah, those guys are hard. No, let me at least kill something. Ah! No. Oof. They're like invincible. Oh my god, they're they were literally not taking any damage. This is, this is Koozie's fault. This this is all Koozie's fault. A hundred percent. Xenon! What a sorry looking kid. Why is Xenon? All alone now. Rest for a bit, Will. I have you now. Thanks, Xenon. Appreciate you, ma'am. And this is our shop. Look at the things on, uh, for sale over there. We already we got a couple gems, you know. Even as a mere child, barely able to walk, you were curious of the dungeons. Yep, see, it's just in my it's in my blood. Ooh, I want to read all those. There is no doubt you carry the same obsession as old Pete. Old Pete, everybody knows old Pete. Morning, boy. Did our little merchant bite off more than he could manage? Yes. That was not fair, though. There were just too many of them. Will, listen to me. The hard truth is this. You are the last of your family. The only one left to run Moonlighter. He's it. He's, you know. He's all that's left. He has to run the shop. You can't keep pushing yourself like this. Risking your life on this fifth door nonsense is foolish. Just leave it. Find some artifacts and then use your pendant to get out of the dungeon. Mm -hmm. And for Crater's sake, stop using that broom of yours, you daft boy. Well, give me something good then. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. It's mine from back in the day. Use it. I have little need for it now. Yay, sword and shield, baby. Let's go. You're wasting light. Can't have you neglect the shop all day. All right, all right. Let's see if I can get you through, if I can get through your head some of the tricks that I picked up from your grandfather so many years ago. All right. Gonna give me a little refresher. I got my ass whooped in the, in the mines or the dungeons. Oh, I love that. Look at the reflect. Like, that's such a small thing. That's such a small thing, but so fun in a video game. I don't, I don't really know exactly why. I think it's because there's typically not reflections in video games. And when there are, it's like, for me at least, I'm like, oh my god. It's amazing. I love that. Successfully selling your merchandise takes knowledge of two things. You must know an item's value as well as its demand. Come now, open the shop and allow customers in. So good. Alright, so what do I just stand here? She's gonna check it, she checks the price, and then you get a face. The smiley face obviously means gonna take it. Taking it. Sell. Cha-ching, that's the best expression you can hope for. The item wasn't too expensive for them and not so cheap for you to lose profit. Oh. Hmm. 
Be sure to pay attention to your customer's expressions. That's how your grandfather always knew if his prices were fair. I love it. And now this guy's coming in. Look, this one's the same thing. But it's price priced at 170 Look at that. Nah, he's sweating. I don't think I need to tell you how that odd item was obviously overpriced. Lessons learned? Finally! Be careful of selling a popular item too much. If you flood the market, you will have to offer your cheaper prices on your wares. The point is, charge higher when something is in high demand and in low supply. Take out your merchant notebook. It should all hold it should hold all this information. Got it. You have gathered on discovered wares and artifacts. Oh, I see. So hit Y. Go right trigger. Okay, yeah. So that tells me for that particular item. And you can kind of gauge the prices. So I think it's important to sell them one at a time until you've established what the price is. Then you can start selling it in bulk. But even then, it will change depending on how many you sell. Would seem the sun has fallen for the day. Well, we only sold one thing. That's not good. I best head off. You'll pick up more on your own. All right, thanks. Restoring this shop to its full glory, that responsibility falls to you, not I. Who is Xenon? Am I related to him? It's in your blood, Will. Make us proud. Who is he to me? In the meantime, why don't you try out that new sword of yours? Dungeons are more perilous at night, but one can always find better artifacts. All right. Just don't dive too far. And use that pendant boy. All right. Oh my guys, Orsi blippin'. Oh my god. Is that boy blippin'? Go on now, these weary bones of mine must rest. Alright, I'm off to the dungeon, because I'm young and... And... What's the word? Youthful. <laughs> Got that youthful vigor. Dungeons, this away. Got it. Wait, can I hit this? Oh yeah. Okay, so we got shield that button, slish slish that button, and roll. I gotta roll more. Oh wait. Oh, I don't think I can, cause, cause it's the first dungeon I. All right. So this reminds me of Cult of the Lamb, where it's like, okay, here's your levels, your five dungeons. This is the golem dungeon. Is it golem or golem? Let's go. Alright. Let's look at our map. Go to the right. I kind of want my right trigger to be the roll. I wonder if I can change that. Ooh, wait, is that a... Oh, it's... Ooh, it's a bug! Wait a minute. This is an empty room! Stamina bar or no? Ooh, ooh, I need sticks. And just up. Alright, alright, I got you. Hiya! 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 Oh, Jesus! Oh god, okay, hit and move. Hit and move. Hit and move. Okay, much better. There we are. Jesus. It's pretty unforgiving. Wait, hold on. I can't. I'm like, I thought I was supposed to. It's because it's this very first dungeon. Dang it. 
Oh, now I gotta fight you here? This is bull. Ow. Jesus. Music is great. Love it. Oh, God. Hello, Pep. Nice to see you. Ooh, wait. Hey, yeah. I feel like I feel like I should be able to go in there, but I can't. Okay, you, you. Ooh, ooh, give me. Oh yeah, we're coming, Mr. Skeleton. Read. To a person of hopefully far better luck than I, my sh my time is short. Hello, Andrea. I took injury from the strange creature across the room. My pendant all but shattered from the scuffle. Check him out, though. I'd say I fared better than he. Ooh, that's him over there. That's been exploded. He caught me spying on him near the Guardian's room. He dropped a couple items when he fled. One of which is this map. Diagram? Whatever it is, I was right. They called me crazy. Said old crazy Pete done gone lost his marbles. Well, we found Pete. But I was right. Each guardian of a dungeon must possess a key of sorts. All of them linked to that giant lock outside the dungeons. The fifth door of Rhinoka. Rhinoka is the name of the town. Sadly, I won't be around to see the door open. To whoever found me, I apologize for the smell. But the diagram should be around here somewhere. Please open the fifth door, Rhinoka. These dungeons are not what they seem. Gimme. Big boss gonna kill me. I suppose to let them all out. Now have to chase this weird creature that stole my stuffs. Ah, big boss gonna be so upset with little me. Oh no. Well. Give me them stuffs. Okay, wait. B. Oh, is that like how many charges it has or something? And there we use the pendant. And we blip right out of here. Type 5, hello, how are you? Harley Quinn, nice to see you. I about died. What's up, Jack? It was your birthday the other day. Well, happy belated birthday, Jack. I hope it was a great one. Ah, the young proprietor of Moonlighter has returned. What a shop name. You look intact. Finally learned to use that pendant properly. Mm. It's about time, boy. What are you holding? Is that a chart of the dungeons? Where'd you get this? You found old Pete. Yep. Dead. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. See, this is what happens when you chase what's behind that door. Leave it, Will. Jesus. Alright. Just get the artifacts you need from the Golem dungeon and look after Moonlighter. Alright. Now, I noticed some posts on the town board that may interest you. Some shops want to move in. Attempt to revitalize this town. Apparently they need some startup capital first. Would be nice to see some new life in Rhinoka. Nice indeed. And, and here's our town to rebuild. Let's go check the bulletin board. Five hundred gold, five hundred gold. So this is staff to run the forge and potions and enchantments. Oh wait. And this is shop upgrades. Ooh. Ooh, you make a bigger shop. Cool. 
Extra space for items, a comfy bed that gives you extra health in the morning. A cash register will entice customers to add an extra 10% tip when paying. Ooh. And a sale box. Items sold in the sale box will have a 75% discount. All right. It's so cool. And then there's still these people that we can't get yet. Tired of looking for the items in dungeons? Leave that job to others and come to Le Retailer, where you'll find the finest items in Rhinoka. Huh. They're basically doing the same thing you're doing, Hawker. Travel the, travel the world looking for techniques to create objects that can inspire people. Visit my cart to find objects that can make your shop look more interesting. Interested in making your money work for you? Trust your money in my hands and I will make it grow before your eyes. Signed, The Banker. Dang, 70000 though. To get. Alright. Can't do any of that right now. What up, Apple Wolf? Boy, Rhinoka has seen better days when your grandpa first opened Moonlighter. People from all over the lands would come to visit the shop. See, this is when it was in its, you know, its boom. The hustle and bustle was constant. But now... Now this. And if you insist on diving deeper into the Golem dungeon, please, Will, make sure to buy some better armor. Alright. You can bring a blacksmith to town using the town board. Alright. Is there anything in these? I've not found anything yet. What's up? Rhinoka. What a town. I sort of always wanted to become a merchant, but I could never find a pendant. Most pendants used today were found when the dungeons were first discovered. Since then, finding a new one has become nearly impossible. Wow. Redman, Masa, my son, when I find you. Oh, Will. Have you seen Masa around by chance? Mm, are you Masa? Tomo, Will. I saw you in the dungeons earlier, mister. Did you bring me anything mysterious? No. Not, not this time. Not particularly. Wait, are you Masa? Masa! Will, can we play tag next time I stop by your shop? You know, your sword doesn't look that much stronger than my wooden one. Is it even sharp? Alright, Masa, listen. Hey man, your kid's over there. Take advantage of the hot spring! Oh my god! Just like Harvest Moon! The water will soothe your aches. Where is that? Where is the uh, hot spring? Maori, have you found any new culture artifacts in the dungeons, Will? I always found it fascinating how the items in the dungeons we find appear to be from entirely different civilizations with unique cultures. Yeah. That is that would be kind of crazy. Wait, dungeons. Wait. Is it night? It's. Hold on, hold on. Let me get my... My things quick. Okay, that... Yeah, yeah, we know. I put those somewhere. Where were they? I had the... I swear I had health potions. I don't know where they went. Not cool. Hold to open shop. Let's go. Oh, wait. Oh, I can't. Hold on. Oh, and I have to sleep. I'm like, I can't go to the dungeons. No, I need to actually sleep and go to bed. That's what I need to do. Okay, wait.
That we know the price of. I literally know the price of nothing. So we just gonna have to guess and judge it. Oh wait, 275 is what it's saying. Okay, we'll try it. Wait, I don't have any. Oh wait, no. I could have swore I looted some stuff and I don't have it now. Did I screw up looting that those chests? Maybe. Oh, oh well. Okay, that is too high of a price, first of all. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start I'm gonna get this set before I open the shop or go to sleep rather. I don't want to do this work in the morning. I want to do it before bed. Uh, 100 was good, but let's do 115 and see if they'll pay that. Okay. The whetstone, no idea. I'm going to put it for, I have like a lot of them. So I'm going to put it for 100 and see if they are offended by the price. Okay. What's this? An iron bar. Iron bar should be like a lot. It should be like a lot. Oh, you know what? If I'm gonna try and sell all of them. Oh, Jesus. There, 105. Yeah. Let's do that. Because we do actually know how much those sell for. So I'll jack the price up a tiny bit. See if they buy all three. You know. A golem core. Teeth stone. Wet, wait, um, let's do a teeth stone. That sounds fun. We'll do a hundred. If they make a face with like gold eyes, I think it means that it's like you're losing money on it. Glasses lens. Let's go a hundred. There we go. And we'll just see what they go for. All right. Let's get some sleep. That Borsa battery is recharging. He went down uh, quicker than I thought he would. Yeah, switch this up. Okay, good morning. Yeah, feels so good. Hmm. All right, so you don't have to do any work. I can just open the store right away. All right, come on in here. Hello. Dang, they were just waiting at the door, huh? Let's see. Checking. Oh wow, way overpriced. Okay, hold on. Wait, was that this one? Yeah. So let's do 50. Okay, he took that. I think that was actually pretty, pretty much on point, but I bet I can sell it for slightly more. Probably won't. Ha yeah, they probably won't like it if I sell it for one and then immediately sell it to someone else for more right after. All right, fifty? No, fifty's still too expensive. Wait, that's the oh, that's that teeth stone one. Mmm. Let's try twenty-five. All right, there we go. How's this? Whetstone? Or no? Oh wow, she did play the inflated press. Heck yeah. And same for the glasses. <laughs> I'm rich. Okay, what? An ancient pot. Ancient pot. Hmm. Okay, I need to figure out how much to sell a stick for as well. Because we gonna have a lot of those. So we'll, let, we'll try like 10 on the stick and see if that's a, an offensive. Now this, I'm gonna put a thousand on it. And if they, they can be, if, I'd rather them be offended a couple times while I figure out how much it's worth. Rather than it be worth like a ten thousand and I sell it, you know, for a hundred. All right, good. All right, now what? Oh God, you guys are waiting on me. Sorry, sorry, sorry about that. Everyone, just check out, please. Sorry, my bad. What do you got? Hmm. 
the stick was a little high for him. So let's try six. Ooh, whetstone way overpriced, okay. While I figure out the prices, it's going to take a little bit, but once I get them for these basic items and you kind of know, I think it'll be a lot easier. Let's try it. Let's try 25 on this one as well. There. Nope. Way, way overpriced on this one. That's fine. Like I said, I don't want to lose money on some ancient pot. I don't know how much an ancient pot's worth. Let's try 500. You bought that stick? Hell yeah. Now I can sell a whole stack of sticks. Place. Perfect. And then... They... Okay, these we haven't quite figured out yet. Alright. Mm, Whetstone's still slightly overpriced. Let's drop it. To 15. Same here. Alright. Nope. They are not. Okay, so the ancient pot's not worth as much as I thought it was, alright? I don't know. Let's try 300. Like I said, I'd rather them just keep telling me no. Loco, take care. Have a nice day at work. Ooh, ooh, they bought it. Okay, okay, okay. So that goes. Perfect. Sell it for six. Same here. Boom. See, now I can put the whole stack. Ooh, we rich. Ooh, I, can, I think I can bring the blacksmith in, actually. Because I've got, I think it's only 500 to bring the blacksmith in. Oh, I'm so good at this. Come on. This is day one, y'all. First try. Never die. See, they come in, they're not finding anything interesting. Oh, he did. Um. Okay, wait, what about this? The vine. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, look, we don't want to sell... I only want to sell one until I figure out how much to sell it for. Let's try ten. Gonna buy the sticks? Huh? Huh? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh no! Oh, they left! No! Wait, did he steal it? Did he just walk out the door? Did I get it back? Oh my god, I'm shook right now. Boy, I had to be fast. Surely he did not steal it, right? Ooh, the, those are still overpriced. All right, fine. Let's try eight. Okay. I'm here. Ancient pot, way overpriced. I really thought that was gonna be like a, you know, like a real win. Okay. Ooh, I didn't price the iron bar either. It's okay. Huh? Wait. He's buying it, but he ain't happy about it. He bought it low. So we'll lower it slightly, right? That's what that is? We'll see if that changes anything. Yeah. Finally, they bought it! mean that it needs to be lower or it needs to be higher 
I'm so confused. The vine is overpriced. Of course it is. No idea what it's worth. Same for the iron bar. I'm gonna try a hundred on the iron bar. There we go. Nope, he's angry. Yeah, no, it's too expensive. I'm so confused on how this price, this, this, what those, I don't know how to interpret those other ones. Were they saying they, they know that they paid too much, but they still bought it. Nope, iron bar, way overpriced. The red face means they're like angry about it. Like it's so overpriced, they're angry about it. Eh? Ooh. But she's paying it. Right, so I need to lower that is what that's saying, right? I'm about to move all my product, y'all. Like to four, maybe try it. Nope, iron bar's still overpriced. Oh. Let's try 45. Mm. See, they make that face, but then they buy it anyway. Y'all send them mixed messages. Oh no, 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 my customers. Ah, oh my God, I did really good. I did 1100 gold. I can get so much. Well. Let me go see if I can bring the blacksmith in. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah. That's right, Vulcan. Moving in. Uh, just like that. He's here. Oh, oh, look at his little apprentice. Oh. I bet he's going to the dungeons too. Mm -hmm. The wooden hat. Another 500 or... Hmm. I think I should get the people first. Yeah. Get potions and stuff. I need to be able to, I want to be able to get that. Oh, it's the builder. That's adorable. Perfect. She's like, hi. Okay, let's go talk to the man over here. Hey. You must be Will. My name's Andre, Forge Master Extraordinaire. If it's weapons or armor you seek, Vulcan's Forge is the place. But your name's Andre. I'm confused. 4,000. Oof. Fabric bandana. Oh, dang. Those are big upgrades. Interesting, you can pick a a type. That's kind of cool. Big swords. Spears. Bows. Ooh. Well, we got a lot of stuff to buy. But if I can get good at doing what I just did. It won't take that long. Add to wish list. Oh, wait. Oh, that's right, because I need to get things. Oh, man. So do I want... Well, I want the fabric bandana and the iron helmet, to be perfectly honest. There. And then for the sword and shield... A vampire short sword. Reborn short sword. Venom short sword. 
rusty. Huh. Kind of like that. I definitely want the the bow. Lightning flame. I mean, lightning bows. <laughs> lightning bow. That's kind of cool. Maybe I do want that. Not crazy about catapult bow. Poison bow. Flamethrower bow. Lightning bow. Yeah. I want those. So that'll, I think we'll make, make it easier to find the items I, I require, that are required for it. Let's check the potion lady before we go. I don't think there's an actual in-game clock. Thankfully. If there is, I have no idea where it's at, where it's located. Oh, a customer. My apologies, it's just this book, it's so good. Yes, yes, I'm Eris, weaver and potion master. Come to the wooden hat when you need a potion or an enchantment. What do you want today? Potions or enchantments? Let's go potions, what do we got? You don't have rich jelly. Oh. Oh. Well, fine then. Hold on. Oh, if I have the components, she'll sell it cheaper to me. But if I don't, I've got to pay a more higher price. I see, I see. Okay. All right. I'm gonna get. I'm getting there. I'm a. I'm a. Wait, wait. <laughs> Ah, yes. I like how the broom counts as, as a spear. Very nice. Don't have... So I can enchant it to get a little bit more out of what I'm currently using as well. Okay. Alright. Vulcan is the Roman equivalent to Hephaestus, god of the forge. Ah, I see. That's why it's Vulcan's forge. Got it. Got it. Good to know. Wait. Ha! Anything? Nothing. Here's the golem dungeon. Okay. I'm afraid maybe there maybe there is an in-game clock. I don't know. Let's find out. We're going to stand right here. What is that? Oh! Okay, I was about to be- It better not be closing! Alright, we're gonna stand here where it's nice and quiet. I'll be right back. I'm gonna be super quick. Don't go anywhere. Leave a like on the video. You guys are amazing. This is a new game. It's called Moonlighter. We're about to go delving in the dungeons, and I'll be right back.
<clears throat> oh, the package. Oh my god. I have to go get it. Oh no. But this boy. I mean, I picked up this boy. I did forget to get the package. But it's because I didn't want this boy to not fought, to not be in his bed. He's very sleepy, as you can see. Oh, boy, you so melty. Oh, can you just sleep like this, boy? Will you just lay like this for me? I'll hold him. I think this okay. He went, boy, you got such fine whiskers. You have these very distinguished whiskers. Oh. Mm. This boy is not made of cheese. This boy is made of some sort of like marshmallow fluff material. Very marshmallowy. You ever heard that Christmas song? He's a marshmallow boy in the winter. That is him. That that song is about him. He didn't know it, but it's about him. It is. Hi, handsome. Oh my goodness, boy. You are the most handsome. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me go grab, let me go check those packages real quick. Okay. Yes, boy, I have a package. I don't know if this is the one. It's in a weird box. An NFL. Is it because, is there like something happening with football right now? Actually, I don't think 
get it. <gasps> Yay! Boy! Oh my goodness! It's the best! Oh, Hims loves them! Yes, he does! Queen, thank you so much for the big, 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 big bag of tracheas. I break these into like three at least. If I get the scissors out, I'll cut them into even smaller. And he, they last so long. They're so good for him. They keep him busy. They're just, they're perfect. Thank you. Let's do this. Boy, you will be so happy. We get to spoil you. And they're basically like a joint supplement treat. Literally, there's no calories in them. Um, if they have too many of them, it literally just like kind of passes through them. But they're such, such a good one. It's kind of thin. This is how I, if I don't have scissors, this is how I have to do it. I literally have to like, there it is. Oh my God, that's such a perfect one. Can I do the other side while we're here? There we go. All right, Bubsy. Here we go. We gotta put these up. Cause we have, we do share with Nixie and Triton. Okay. Boy. Because you the best one. You the bestest of the bestest ones. And you know it. Boy. I love you. And so does Queens. And so does everybody else in the stream. And we want you to have the best life ever. And you deserve it. He's like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go over, I'm gonna go over here. He said, that's fine, boy. Okay, enjoy your trachea in peace. No, I felt, I thought about making him do a trick gears, but sometimes I want him to just have them because him deserves them. And it's like, he knows when certain things are his. It's so funny. He knows. All right, let's go back to the dungeon. That was great fun. Thank you, Queens. That boy is enjoying himself right now. This makes me want to play Cult of the Lamb again. Chim boy is a good boy. Yes, he is. My, I'm not quite happy with my controls just yet, but ooh, what the heck is this? Eh? Why? Why do our tools keep disappearing? Chambers full of precious stone are left untouched, but rooms and chests holding our most basic tools keep vanishing. It's weird. What's going- what's in here? I'm scared. Do I just jump in? Whee! Oh wait, is this the hot spring? All right. It's like, I'm in. Come on. All right, let's go. Ah! Ah! Get that fucking off me. I, I like that I can actually use the rocks, though, as, oh my god. Ugh. Give me that. That's what I need. There, I'm healed. I'm healed. There is an up back here as well, though. Oh, I almost missed that. Bing. Oh. Oh my god, the combat is gonna take me a little bit. Ah! Jesus. Ah! Ah! Hard. Quick move all. Yup. Oh, 
I like how there's little tiny things you squish on the floor. Oh my god. Oh! Oh my god, I hit the vase. That's hilarious. But first try, never die. Good to know. Empty room, though. Whoa! Oh my god. Alright, get it together. Get it together. What's that? What is that? I bet that's something. I bet that's something. Wait, can I revitalize myself in the hot spring? Oh my god. Please tell me. Yes, I can! Amazing. All right, good, good. All right, onward. Oh, hey, oh, cool. I actually move. Oh, oh, get off me. Yep, I'm deep. I'm deep. I'm deep. a porky pig impression. Ah. This is hard. Like, I like it hard, but it's, it's definitely not like easy. That's for sure. Well, thank you. Fabric. Okay. Okay, we're going we're going back to the hot spring. Right. Do this as many times as I want. You can hear him going. Yes. Oh my god. He loves the tracheas. They're probably one of his favorites. That and like the chicken beat. Oh! It's all used up! Oh ma'am! Okay. Wait a minute. There's one I didn't go to over here. Eh? different part of the dungeon. Ooh, ooh, what the heck? All right. What's that? Whoa, that was all trippy and then it, <gasps> look. What the heck? Something's here. I don't think it, I don't think it's anything in particular, but it is very trippy looking. Okay. Onward. I feel like because I don't know what a lot of the tell tells in the dungeon are. Like, I'm missing a lot. What? Huh? Today marks my first steps in these dungeons. They were discovered not far from Rhinoka, a small and incredibly charming village just north of the crater. And they are quite a unique occurrence. Any number of adventurers may enter a dungeon at once, but no one will adventure together. 
These dungeons seem to build themselves around the one entering. Ooh. A unique maze for each person. Never the same labyrinth twice. One must ask, though. If no one is currently inside the dungeon, does it even exist? Now, these questions. These, these are the questions. Oh my god, that is great. Many right now are flooding to these dungeons for their treasure, completely disregarding the inherent danger of the hostile creatures inside, just for some old golden fame. But not I, no, it's all about the questions for me. Hmm. Where did these dungeons come from? Oh yeah. Why do they constantly shift and change? And why are they filled with unseen treasures? I'm not here for the what. I'm here for the how and the why. Oh. Is that the end? Oh, it was. I thought I closed it by accident. Hello? Hello? Huh? heal. Okay, let's use it. Alright. Mm -hmm. There we go. Much better. It's really, it is kind of like Cult of the Lamb in that clearing each room efficiently is really important. Is that it? I did! I clear. Wait. I did not clear the whole thing. Holy moly. Antonio, thank you so much for your membership. I appreciate that. Nine months, a whole human could be conceived and born in that time. It's amazing. I appreciate you, Antonio. This looks like the only one. Oh, I did miss this down here. <gasps> what the F? A golem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I thought we were wait. I thought he was doing like a hello. Oh no. Wait. Oh my god. I'm so. Get out of it. No! Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I got greedy. Oh, you don't get what's in your. Oh. Inventory. Now I understand. Death by misadventure. What? Never. Never. Well. Oh, wow. Okay, so it doesn't just send me home for the night. That's good. Good. I clearly just need practice. Does not look easier. Oh, that might look better though. Go! Oh! Couldn't really see his life. So the things that are wish list, wish listed. Oh, I need to organize those better. I 
still need that, but... Hopefully we can... We can make it out this time. I should have just left. I should have just failed, man. I don't know what I was doing. Oh my god, it's a mimic. Ah! I'm getting more stuff. I can tell you that for sure. spider. Up. Oh, the hot spring. Yay. Yeah, yeah, this. Oops. <sighs> there we go. But it's limited. It's not infinite. So we gotta remember that. Oh my god. Ouch! Oh, Jesus! Get it together. Calm down. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's so hard. Mm, I need to go back down and go left, maybe. Because last time, the other door in the hot tub room did not end well. Don't fall. Are you take it? Wait a minute, eh? Oh, stop it. No, ah, stop it. There, there we go. getting full <sighs> need to be really careful oh no this is bad wow I did it okay Should I just leave? This is this is how gonna be my my learning curve is like getting greedy. leave. I got no more health potions. I got 48 health. Nah, we need to leave. Goodbye. <laughs> don't get hot. Don't get hot. I have to break out my don't get hot shirt. Seriously, because it is like so tempting to stay, but every room is like rolling the dice. Uh oh. I guess you got a little 
cookie bread breadstick boy. A little piece of one in. Hey, hey, hey. That is not for Mr. Wellington's, sir. Alright. Go to town. Go to town. I'm glad the uh, blacksmith appears to work late. The forge is ablaze! Alright, let's go. Um, I don't have... I need the gold. Okay. Well, then how do I... Will it still tell me that in my inventory? I hope so. Hold on. We were still trying to price that iron bar, so I'll leave that one. And I need that as well. We can we can leave that. Oh, but the rich jelly now I needed I know for some other stuff. So I'm gonna keep that actually for let's sell let's sell one to find out how much is worth. We'll see, and then sell those the vines. Okay. All right. Mm hmm. button. It's okay. I'm still learning, guys. There. Keep these. Wait, why aren't those? Oh, they are. I was like, why aren't those the same? There. A rune tool. All right, let's go to sleep. Actually, let me go mark. Put those on the wish list as well, just so I can make sure. Hello. Potions. Mm. This one. 118. Okay. So it only takes one and you ma make a potion. That That's what I gotta do. And I'll be able to buy quite a few like that. Okay. Now, ready for bed. And I need to adjust my posture. And do a good praise the moon as we play Moonlighter. This game is really fun. Oh. And I love the twist on it, but I also love the similarity of so many, you know, so many other games that I love. It's just their specific blend is really unique and fun. Open the shop. Let's go. I have a feeling the jelly's gonna be too much. That was a little overly priced, so let's adjust. 150, perhaps? The vines? Eh? Eh? You want it. Mmm. Still overpriced. 
Let's try 35. Whoop, what'd you get? Oh yeah, those they love those. I didn't see what he was it was still just a little too much. Both of those all still a little too much. 25 100 Let's do 50 Mmm What is it? A vine something? Hey! Alright. 25 on the iron bar, but I need those, so... Yep, you'll also buy- of course you'll buy the core for 100. Shoulda known. An empowering crystal. Let's try 150. Too much, but not angry too much. So that gives me a little bit of hope. The jelly? What? The jelly you you think is overpriced? That badly overpriced? Really? It's way more valuable to me. For the potions? Maybe not eventually, though. It'll be fine to sell it eventually. Mmm. We got that out there. Oh, yeah. Let's put these out there. Those sold those sold pretty good. That'll be a four hundred and some if we can sell that. Come on, old man, buy them. Oh man, see he made that gold face? That tells me I way underpriced it. Dang. So we gotta we gotta jack up the price of this vine. Like a lot. Let's let's double it and hope that, that it wasn't any more than that. A rune tool. That sounds really special, so let's try like 500. And just let them let them tell us it's too much. Alright, Sabertooth, thank you so much. Praise the moon indeed, my friend. I'm glad you got some D&D planned. That's always a good time, man. Always a good time. Okay, too much, but not an in insane amount too much. So let's try 150. Oh, they still angry about the jelly, man. Let's try that. What did he buy? Oh no! Wait. Are you sitting? I put like five hundred on that one, I think. <gasps> and he made this face like, oh, I got so screwed on the rune tool. Well. They still say this was too much? They, they crazy if they think I'm gonna sell these jellies for this cheap. It's okay. You are fine. You are totally fine, boy.
I was afraid I wouldn't have too much to offer, considering how much I was keeping. But. Oh my god, but he bought it. All right, y'all. Shop's closed. Get out of here. We're done. 1800, not a bad day. Not a bad day. Boy, he's okay. He's okay, boy. <laughs> Oops. Hmm. I don't have 4,000. Ooh, ooh, I want that. Whoops. Um, add to wish list so that I can... Do that. Now let me buy a, a few potions. Quick. Yeah, five is still a lot. Oh, well there, that's better. 593 for five potions. Got it. Yes. Thank you. There we go. I go throw these in the in the chest. Get out of my shop. Will. Alright. Into the dungeon. I need to... I've got 1,200. So what I really need are like a couple good loot runs to get 4,000 to upgrade my... Probably my weapons first. Because I think I need to get good at not getting hit. I need to let the armor be like a later reward. But... I just need to get hit less. That's, that's the real, you know upgrade I need to get. It's just you need to hit, get a hit list. Okay, but we're going to because first try, never die. Alright. Good money so far. What's that? Oh! Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, that stick fell. That sucks. Move all. Those have to stay. Why can't I put that there? must be placed oh oh I got you got it got it got it I understand now I understand now okay Ooh, that's a that's an important one huh I see those those things are what I'm probably gonna need to send um, or to, oh Jesus to sell Oh god, oh god. Wrong button to dodge. But I also need them. Ooh, this is tricky. 
to level up my stuff. But the trick is to get just enough and then sell the rest. Jess Hopkins, welcome to Pro Gamer. Oh my god. Jess Hopkins, thank you so much. Jess Hopkins sound like somebody like I grew up with. Which if you are, that's amazing. But if not, also still so cool. And thank you for the Pro Gamer status. I appreciate that. Amazing. Yeah! Exactly. Exactly, Queens. Oh, God. Skylar Mars in the house. Someone added me to their Hispanic Heritage Wrestling poster today, and I might die of happiness. I am so happy for you, Skylar. Don't die of happiness, though. That would make me sad. But I am glad that you are happy. And that is great. To be uh, featured on a, you know, on a wrestling poster of any sort, but especially one that's really important to you. So congrats on that. Oh, jeez. The combat looked simple when I watched reviews of this game, and it is not. Ah, that's a freaking mimic. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Get out of here, you. Get out of here, you. Ooh, good. Another one of them rune tools. I'm gonna get the prices right on that bad boy. We won't make that mistake again. I made those five potions, but the idea is not to use them, you know? Ooh. Yeah, yeah! Getting better, y'all. Okay, dead end here. Up. Hmm. Yeah. I just need I need to make it out with all of this. Those moves That's what I'm talking about. Oof, Jesus. Get it together. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, I need to save those potions for when I absolutely need it. Leave the rest. <gasps> Never mind. You know, that's some bullshit. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I got out. I got out. It, did you see the the swing on that thing? Jesus. I still have the I still have them. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. Same thing, I'm gonna jack this one up just a little bit as well. They sold too easy last time. I'm gonna put it on a thousand. Cause I got screwed last time. And then the diamond things. in our chest of things. I don't really... I don't really have anything to sell. I got some vines. I, I need... All I have to sell is what I got down there. But if I sell those things... I'm doing all right, so I'm gonna call it a win. Can I sleep? Or wait, do I open the shop? I can't remember. I'm not sleeping, I guess. Man, that'd be brutal. Be out dungeon crawling all night long. Come back in like, ugh. I feel like I look tired. Long time subscriber. Thank you so much, Jess Hopkins. That's amazing. It's also weird. It's always weird for me to call someone else Jess. <gasps> Dang! Even a thousand? Wow. I'm getting destroyed here. Just destroyed. Absolutely destroyed. Wait, did I miss someone? Oh my god, I better not have. I might have, I might have gotten screwed, but if I did, it's fine. I'm, I'm learning. There we go. Oh, that's even better. Okay, okay. All right. Thank you. And then I put this in. Yep, like that. I'm gonna save those vines because I feel like I might need them for something at some point. I made. A pretty decent amount of money. I got 2900 One more day and I'll be able to have um, what I need. Alright, good night everyone. Take care. Not a bad day. I think the town is pretty hard up. Sabretooth. Like, they were ravaged pretty, you know, rough. From all of the deaths of everyone, you know, dying from the dungeons. Pretty pretty brutal. What'd you think? Jess is short for Jessalyn. Wow, I've you know, I've never heard that. Jessamine, Jessalyn. How about that? I've actually had people think that was my name. It's exactly the same, just the L. It's great. Um, oh wait. Oh no, I gotta, I got <gasps> But the dungeons are more rewarding at night, they said. Huh. Let's just try a daytime dungeon run, see what that's all about. Bloop. And we are glad you're here, Jess. I appreciate you. Okay. I gotta remember the boss is out the other entrance of the hot spring. No. Oh. I I need to find those freaking 
rune things again. Oh, wait. There. And then trade you out. Mm-hmm. Mm. We need to just not get got. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I hate that they fall like that. That's really a bummer. I was there. I should have gotten those. I bet there's an upgrade that makes you more, um, like you, you know, like a magnetic one. See, there's something sparkling there. Can I get a fishing pole and fish these suckers? Now, I ain't stupid. I know that right over there. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna go back the other way. Out the other door of the hot spring is what, people? We know what it is. It's the golem, and right now. He F's me up. Hardcore. So. Oh, see what the fuck is that? Get out of here. You're a bastard. You're a red bastard. Oh, I can't hold any more. Dang. Well, I definitely want the majority then. <sighs> These were pretty pricey. Oh, they also have to be. Damn! So. Yeah, these. Top or bottom of the back. Oh. Huh. I really like how they're. They, they arrange these things. The inventory management is, is cool. Let's go. Oops. find a place for these. No, no, no. There it is. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of wild, actually. I need to be getting out of here soon. Get up, get on me, get on me. Ah! Get off me! Those guys are the worst! I have to use a freaking potion. So, I was attacked by a moving rock today. Can you imagine a rock that moves? I did what any sensible person would do in this situation and smacked it right back. It shattered upon the ground 
leaving behind a stone heart. A core, as we have come to call it. It's one of the many unique treasures that can only be found in this dungeon, dropped by a guard unique to only this dungeon. I have to say, each of these dungeons has, have a very particular environment, a culture that's all its own. I do find the lore interesting. No! Are you kidding me? Get off me. It's insane, dude. One more room. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty much full. And this is another dead end. Leaving the entire, yeah, right there. Oh, yo, oh, Jesus Christ. We're getting out of here. Full, full, yeah, oh my god, I did not realize I moved behind my map. Okay, good to know. All right, we're getting out of here. <laughs> what up, Jonathan Leftwich? Hello, how are you? We gotta set up some merch. We gotta we gotta move some merch, y'all. Okay. Uh, quick move. There. Hmm. Okay. Well, this is what we have to sell. It's not much, but it's gonna have to do. The nighttime dungeon runs are more, um, lucrative, you could say. Let's try 115. Same with these. All the prices are going up. All of them. Yeah. Okay. Love it. Okay, now we'll sleep to get it to be morning time. <laughs> Our fam is the best fam. Oh, the fam. We still the fam. Yeah, I need all of this. We gotta move all this merchandise. Okay, I just, let's do this day. I was like, I just went oh, by my second hour. Yes, this is perfect. We're gonna do this day. I'll take a quick break. Oh, wait, hold on. Hold on, I don't want them selling, I don't want them walking out with my merch. I guess they figure if you don't, um, Come check them out, they can just take it. Whatever. Fine, I'll pause. Um, hold on. I need to set something quickly, y'all, if you'll give me one moment. One quick, did you guys see how cute that thumbnail of Mr. Wellington is? the redirect. Thank you. 
One moment, y'all. Let me figure this out. Studio, under videos. Customization. Redirect. There it is. Jesus. Boom. There we go. That's what I need. Okay. And so tonight, I have my stream set up, you guys, to redirect. To RJ City's YouTube channel, and you can watch him play The Quarry right now, which is an amazing playthrough. You, if you're just like, ah, I just watch video games, like this, he, this is, you know, some of the rare video game content that he does on his channel. It's actually not true. He does all kinds of video game content, but it's pretty serious and it's scary, and he doesn't really do scary games. So it's been a hilarious playthrough, absolutely amazing, so worth it. Please go watch it, support it. Remember to like those videos as well. Um, but YouTube has a feature that allows us to redirect, so when my stream is over, it will just kick over to his stream automatically, which is awesome. Um, so, that's what I was trying to set up. And I forgot to do it before I went live. Alright, now. Buy me up, guys. Yep. Just buy everything. Buy it all. They, they mad about it. They paid it, but they mad about it. Okay, we got 4,000, which means I need to upgrade, so probably get uh, get the sword upgrade. They're paying the inflated price. All right. All right, close the shop. Get out of here. What up, Blue Shades? Every day I've done more mo more money, more sales. It's great. Okay. <laughs> okay, do we want like the regular sword or the, you know, special effects sword? And I guess you're not really limited, but it looks like you pick one and kind of go that way. It just costs more. But I guess if you didn't like it, you could go back the other way. Uh... Oh, I require it requires something I do not have. Oh, I have to get the regular one first. Well. Well, that's cheaper than I thought, at least. Or, no, can't get the big sword. Ooh, I could get the spear. The gloves. Oh my god, this reminds me of Hades. I need a couple more branches to get the bow.
minus 10 speed. These are all pretty much the same, it looks like. Except for what the upgrades are. Hellspear. That sounds fun. So there's like an elemental version and a regular version. That's basically the differences. Shoot. I'm kind of tempted to maybe just get actually get the armor first, unlike what I said, and then do one more run. And then have enough to get the weapon. Because right now, the weapons are only like a thousand. Yeah, same for the bow. So that'll be two thousand. To get a, a basic weapon. And the bow. Two thousand. But four thousand for the armor. I'm gonna take that speed. We're gonna take that speed right there. We're gonna we're gonna get the uh, new headband, fresh bandana. That's what we getting. Yep, get it for me. Bang. Got it. Add that baby to the wish list. Okay. Yeah, I did not even like. See that. So that is actually what I need. Not the other one. Just yet, anyway. I'll be able to bank one of those pretty... Uh, one of these... Uh, the glove one might be cool, but the that's gotta be range on that's gotta be... Right? But speed... Spears are always a really good one because, you know, obvious reasons, the range. All right. When does Will sleep? Oh my God. Alpha Wolf was just playing Hades. I actually did too, not too long ago. I was I was pretty excited about it. Boy, of course, you come over here right when I get here. Okay, super quick break, guys. Super duper quick. And look who just came over here to join us. And then I'm gonna stream until 10:15. All right. And then the stream is gonna redirect to RJ City's channel. So be sure you guys check that out. But it's not over yet. It's not over yet. Okay. So give me just a couple minutes. And I'll return.
come back, everybody. And uh, he didn't, uh, he did not rouse the boy. So you, that's how you know he's really tired. All right, into the dungeon. Have I gotten any deeper into Hades? Um, there was more than just getting to the surface. I did know that I beat it. I beat Hades once. And then I realized there was like a lot more that it was gonna require multiple times and that there was a lot more to it. I kind of thought like, ah, oh, I beat it. But I know that I did not, at least not fully, which is why I've kind of, it, it kind of leaves room for me to like have another playthrough, like I have another run at it and feel like there's more to strive for. I gotta use my shield more. Also, really, I'm not crazy about my, my controls. Whoa! Yeah, I gotta like not spaz. Are you kidding me? Ooh, it's a forest. Go. Those look like a Pokemon. Pokemon. Oh, Jesus. God, the woods are trippy. So trippy. Ooh, these are bigger. Wow. Okay, cool. What? Okay. I do feel like I'm slightly faster. Whoa! Oof. Didn't see them rocks there. Thank you. Cursed. Wait. Price. Whoa, wait, what? Oh, what? I didn't put my headband on. Oh my god. I wasn't faster. Oh my god. Okay. Price. But you don't know what the price is. Find the hot spring somewhere. Yep. Okay, good, good, good. Don't go out that door. We learned we learned our lesson. Go back to the left and then up. That's where we gotta go. I love how this is 50% exploited.
Found time to go home soon. Oh boy. Woo! Oh, what the heck? He was like invincible for a second. It's all right. I'm about to I'm about to bolt out of here, so we we gonna be fine. Oh yeah, and then you find the little story. When I upgrade my weapon the first time, well, the first specialized weapon, not the first training weapon, then I'll try to fight the golem. golem. The golem. If you pass out in the dungeon from exhaustion or pain, it spits you out eventually. It's a messy ordeal. No one really knows what happens, but one eventually wakes up outside the dungeon with only small traces of slime nearby. And, well, any injuries they may have accumulated inside. I cannot wait to find out what this game is throwing at you, story-wise. I cannot wait. It's, a, it's got me really very, very interested. Some dungeons... Some have left the dungeons to never return, but plenty have stuck it out. Many enjoy the thrill of the fight. Many looking for that big payday. There really is so much more to these dungeons, though. Yeah, I'm with you. Now, what I have is... Can I leave if I just walk out the door. Because I've now exploited all of it. Yep, 100%. Yep, yep, yep. Nope. So I gotta spend 200 to leave. Or fight the thing. So I'm, I'm just gonna spend the, the money and leave. We'll make that much. Adorable. guys see the picture I posted of this boy today that's him in the mornings like I can't I can't even handle him what 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 a uh, flying golem what how do I select it what I'm not really sure I understood exactly what was going on there. Mm. Mm. I can sell some of those shard things. Not a ton, though. I'm kind of thinking maybe spear and bow. Or glove. Glove and bow. Like ranged. That's maybe not a bad idea. Ranged and then up close. Kind of might be fun. Let's check the board. Yeah, I need to spend my upgrades on armor and weapons first and get to at least a decent standard. Okay, okay, hold on. What are we selling today? Move, move. Fabric? I 
kill that guy. But we don't know the price of these. But we know these aren't very expensive, so. Mm -hmm. Okay, quick move. Like that. Try and sell that. want that. <sighs> there. There. Okay. And then these two. And then, oh yeah, that, the ancient pot, that sphere. try and sell the plant flesh I guess as well see what that's all about there I'm actually gonna keep the iron it's not really worth enough to like justify selling it not when I not when I need so much of it okay let's set up our shop do we know how much these are worth nope we'll do 500 and hope it ain't a scam they'll pay that they'll pay it we don't okay we don't know on this one so let's put it back and do just one there and try like try a, a hundred and see how that goes okay there we go all right opening the shop everyone opening the shop huh you want anything hmm wow they Bought that up right away. Huh? Yup. So we can afford the bow for sure. Let's put. I'm gonna put 500 on this one too, just to see what you know. And you gotta watch their faces and see how they respond. Huh? Okay, the water spear, he's fine with 100. Could probably sell it for a little more. What about you? Oh no, way too much on the... This one. Try 300. But let's crank this up just a little. Close. Too expensive, but not too much over expensive. Perfect. Close. Let's try three hundred. Come on, you licky lose. Get over there and search. Go through my my wares. Nope, he mad about it too. 
Be like, how dare you charge this? Let's try 200. Ancient pot? Eh? You wanted to buy that ancient pot, man? All right, plant flesh, we got no idea. So let's try 200. What do you say? Still. Nice. Ah, it should be somewhere in the middle. Try 250. Actually, actually, actually. Oops. See, he made those gold eyes, which tells me he found himself a deal. Nope. This one is not worth. Was that not a. I thought that was a special item. Am I mistaken? Fair, 250 is a fair price, they say. Well, if 250 is fair, then so is 260. These can probably be increased a little. Nope. She's angry about it too. Really? A hundred is still overpriced for this? Hmm. Let's try sixty. Somebody buy these things so I can get another upgrade. Come on. Rana, welcome back. A wee wee to you. Buy it. Yes. Yes. Good, good. Give me. Yeah. Ooh, 3,900. Really? to just literally sell like one thing anything anything nope oh this oh don't no, get it oh that there we go yeah there we go nice Oh my god, I can do it. Well, now the question is, do I get the weapons or do I get the other armor? Now that I have enough. Oh, he only bought some. Interesting. I thought they would buy the whole sack. Do you get to be a blacksmith? No, no, there's a blacksmith in town. You're not the blacksmith. You just run your shop. Oh, yeah. Woo, boy, they bought me out. I did good today. Very good. Nice. See, this is the blacksmith down here. What's up, Andre? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, get that armor.
Yeah. There we go. <gasps> Wait a minute. I thought you could wear both. Are you kidding me right now? What? Wait a minute. I did not realize. I thought the armor slots were both. Yeah, I thought the one was going your shirt here. I thought that's what that was. No, it's an iron helmet. Oh my god, I don't know why I thought it was armor. It looked like a waistband to me. Oh. Can I un. <gasps> I know what to do. I know what to do. Saves come. Saves come. It saved as soon as my day was over. So we're going to reload it real quick. That was a mistake. Don't make the mistakes that I make. You see? Look at that, money's back. Right back where we left off, perfect. Okay, then I know what to do. Weapon time, weapon time, everybody, weapon time. Mm. Mm. Yeah, get out of here. Okay, we go bow first. Poison bow. And then I'm thinking we go gloves. The And the weapons are way cheap. It would honestly be totally fine to get several of them and try them and just see what you like, see what feels good, what you do good with kind of thing. Oh no, I used those. Oh no. Oh god, the big sword, the big training sword is the only one I can make right now. Hilarious. But you know, that's kind of balanced out by my, by my bandana. Maybe I'll do that. Big sword. Big sword and a bow and arrow. It's all I can make right now, honestly. Which is the other reason. Let's go. Yep. Sweet. Wasn't expecting big sword, but now it is. Quick equip. Quick equip. <laughs> quick, quick equip. Yeah. Yeah, yes. Uh. Okay. We got five potions. We got 2,000. Um. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I can keep my money. Because I don't want to lose it if I die in the dungeon. Because we about to start trying to fight the golem. Go golem. Go 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 Woo! Okay, so it is slower. And you've got to take that into consideration when fighting. But there's unlimited ammo with the bow and arrow. And then if I get in a bad spot, wham! Talk about sliss sliss. Oh, is this like my my farm? <laughs> Golem. 
Yeah, Gollum is Gollum from Lord of the Rings. That's Gollum. G-O-L-L-U-M. Golems are like stone golems, clay golems, you know. Oh, cool power shot. And then what about, wham, nice. Cool. All right, this is gonna be a fun one. Wait, did I empty everything? Oh, God dang it. I gotta put, I gotta put up my sword and my broom and my sword and shield. The broom, I don't even need the broom anyway. Why am I carrying the broom around? Can I sell my stuff? That'd be funny. I can, what? My broom spear. Who knows, if somebody wants to buy them, they can. We'll see, we'll see what they offer for it. Merchants and heroes, but what if you're both like me? All right, I'm kind of tempted to try to fight the golem thing. Golem, golem, golem. And if I if it gets in a bad situation, I do have my pendant to evacuate, and I've got more than enough gold to do that, as you can see. Oh, you can't shoot over. Oh, this is amazing. Gotta love it. Yup, just get on those diagonals, baby. So good. Good start. Beauty. Beauty! Allows me to be a little more strategic. Water lamp. I think I've gotten those before. Got it. Oh, it shoots through them. Very nice. Very nice. Hello, Skeletor. Read? Oh, let's read his note. Oh, I want to read it. There. The, go the golems lurking amongst these stone walls are sturdy, but all their combat abilities are clumsy and easy to predict. Some of these guys can proper stun you if they land a hit, though. This is true. I like how the skeletons are the ones giving you the combat. <laughs> Not sure I would trust the skeletons. Empty. Okay. Ooh. They are like moths, like moths to a flame, I tell you. These adventurers, so many attracted to the dungeon, so many to only feel the burn. Luckily, if you pass out in the dungeon from exhaustion paint, it spits you out, eventually. It's a messy ordeal, and no one really knows what happens. But eventually, one wakes up outside the dungeon, with only a small trace of slime and, uh, well, any injuries they may have accumulated inside. Yes, some have left the dungeons to never return, but plenty have stuck it out. Yeah, I read that one. It would be so weird 
But you know people would be doing this. If there was some place and they honestly couldn't explain it. And couldn't control it. And people just wanted to show up and... And go search for treasure? Yeah, I, you know people would. You know there'd be people out there that'd be willing to risk it. Oh! Oh! What in the F? Okay, hold on. Oh my god, that was the wrong button. Okay, why can't I... Oh! I gotta get him stunned. I see. Come here. Come here, come here. Okay, first of all, you gotta go. He's hard. It's hard to get him to rush you. There it is. There it is. God, he was tough. I'm excited so far with just the the small variety of enemies I have seen. They've all required very, very specific strategies, and it's not just hack and slash. Cult of the Lamb is great. The combat is very simple. It's it's fine. It serves the purpose. It's it's you know it's good and all, but man, this is this is really something else. This is. I know I make the just like Dark Souls joke all the time, guys, but for real, it's not just like Dark Souls. But there's definitely some similarities. Okay. Hot tub. Let's make sure we've uh, fully exploited 100%. Oh, I don't think so. There was certainly something down here we did not fully exploit. Ah! Get off me! Ah! Couldn't get swinging. But once you do, man, ain't no stopping you. Nope. You really gotta be on point with that. I'm, I don't like wasting my... my heals at all. Is one artifact in direction shown. But like any, like. Hmm. But there's nothing there. So there. How about that? It's like they're cursed. Which is fun. 
It's a fun thing to work around. two heals let's give golem king a try with like my bow too i might do better than i'm thinking i'll do and i can always evacuate if things get out of control got two heals i got some, you know fresh armor okay okay, okay. just get ready <sighs> i would have had more heals than that if i hadn't Roll, 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 stick and move. Roll, 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 stick and move. Later, Jonathan. Wish me luck against the Golem King here. All right, let's go. We're not going to stick around while he says hello. Oh! Oof. Okay, hold on. Okay, I can only shoot on straights. Woo! To go to town and drop off what I got. I had to try. I know, Mr. Man. Can you believe that? I can't. Boy. Boy, can you believe that? Can't believe that. Oops. Let's... I want to check with my... Mm -hmm. Smiths real quick. Yeah, that's definitely going on. On the list, but I don't, I don't even know what I need for that yet. I do have enough for that now. Catapult bow. Forty-four thousand, Lord! Quite the jump, ain't it? Some more potions. Mm -hmm. I brew ten of the potions, and I'm going on my way now. Rock, Toxic, Blaze, Storm. I mean, they're kind of badass. Or you just go pure big sword. 
Probably that's what I would go. And I will need the rune for that. There's the freaking chest plates. Okay, that is really, really easy to miss. <sighs> okay, 4,000. Well, at least we have a goal now. Yeah, let's set, okay, wait, no. Um, iron, steel, boots. I got everything I need for that. Am I wearing boots? I wonder why I can jump straight to that one. Fabric. Iron. Steel. see what I'm wearing. Literally nothing. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we've marked that for the head. And then boots. Steel fabric. This isn't this is not this needs to be fixed. Speed. Mm. I think I want the speed. The fabric boots. Yeah. And I can, I can already make them with what I have, but I'm putting them on the wish list anyway, so I keep all the stuff that I need. Okay, so now all I need is the money. So we're gonna see what we can sell. Now that I marked those. Not a ton. Maybe these, these might be worth a lot. I'm gonna keep the iron, and actually I'm gonna sell one stack of the iron. It's not worth very much, but. Life fluid. That's got to be worth a ton. Where's it go? There. Potions. Backup potions. And, then, and stuff to sell. Now, I doubt those weapons and stuff are gonna go for that price, but we'll find out. We don't know at all what a water lamp goes for, so we'll try 200. We'll sell these bad boys. Yep. All right, opening the shop. Let's go. Assassin's Creed set in Japan is finally in the works. Wow. They've definitely, you know, that's been one that's needed to happen for quite some... I knew it! I knew it. I knew I was under underselling myself on that one. Ugh. Oh, well. That's how, this is how we learn. There, 400. Yeah, yeah, you lucky old man. Sell for 30. Like, 
but not massively overpriced. That's what's crazy. Come on. Hey. Good stuff. Good deal. Nobody is looking at my <laughs> my weapons and my armor. <laughs> oh, oh, dang it. That's not what I meant to do. So let's do 500 and watch it, you know, watch me undersell myself. Come on, y'all. Take a peek. Watch him be like, bling! I'm gonna be mad. Mm. Okay, good. So it's not horribly overpriced. Let's try 400. Are these like so outpriced that they're not even... They're not even considering them? Nope. Close. Let's try 350. Come on, old man. Are you interested? They're not even checking those. I'm wondering if you can even sell them. 350, no. Let's try 300. There. Y'all ain't even checking them. Start with 250 on the leaves. 250. Any interest? I love how I have white hair. Ah, shit. I undersold myself bad. Nah, they... they I wonder if... It's, if it's because they're not adventurers, they have no interest in that. You know what I mean? Like, wait, bye, 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 bye. There we go. Life. Life fluid? Gotta be worth at least a thousand. Gotta be. Alright. I do like how I can tell that the sun is going down. That's fun. Let's see. Too expensive? Too rich for your blood? Yeah, too rich. Okay, fine. Uh, we'll try 500 then. You better not be happy about it. Nope, but we're getting warmer. Come on, somebody buy it for 400 so I can have 4,000. Get myself some chest armor. I thought I had just not unlocked the armor or something and that the head stuff was all I could craft right now. I didn't know. But now I do. Hey! We got it. That's great. Perfect. 4,000. That's all we needed. Yeah. All right. Get out of here, y'all. Oh, if you sell them... 
like your prices are too high, but they buy them anyway. They they get mad about it. All right, let's get ourselves some armor. Hmm. Get this good leather armor right here. Oh. Keep an eye on that. Beautiful. Why do they have the star by them, I wonder? I'm running low on the gold, which means I need to just go try and fight. I don't know how I managed to teleport out of that golem fight the first time. I got really lucky. And I can't teleport now because I don't have enough gold. But I got potions and I got new um, new armor. So that should be very helpful. It's the equivalent of a bad Yelp review. Kinda, yeah. Just, just throughout the town though. Oh, oh god, oh, there was freaking rocks there. I'm like, why am I not moving? Oh god, you're... Oh my god, oh, oh my god. You're the worst. What? Oh god, wrong button! See? I do... I, I might need to look at the... Oh my god. Those do not heal very much. Oh my god. This is not my best work. I would hate to see what very hard looks like on this game. I love that hard was the recommended level uh, difficulty though. God, this boy is snoring so loud. <laughs> Not my best work. I blew through those potions, too. Just handle business. Oof. Oof. Oh, 
son of a mother. This thing's gonna kill me. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, Jesus. Oh, he was in the air, Jesus. He tried to steal my treasure. Oh my God, get out of here. Oh my god, you're a bastard. You know that? Oh my god, look at him stealing my treasure. Treasure is what a jerk. No! Oh my god, give me those, give me those, give me those, give me those, give me those. Oh my lord. That was it, that was all my heals. I knew I was gonna fall. Oh my god, don't oh, ah! <laughs> fall apart, man. <laughs> I'm struggling. Heels? Heels? those. Come on. Give them to me. <gasps> I freaking have enough. How did I get enough? I don't know how I got enough, but I got enough that I can actually teleport out now. Oh my god. I can actually do it. I need to do it before I die and just take because I got some good stuff. I got some very good stuff. I need to just go. See, I got that thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta go. We got to go. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah, nah. God damn, mimics. 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 I learned how awful mimics could be the first time when I played Baldur's Gate 2. You think it's not a big deal? Oh, it is. Oh, it's a big deal. Lord. Okay. Well, I'm gonna need these. Save up that other stuff. We can sell this this stuff. No, I'm gonna keep the red, the red goo. Um, I'm gonna keep the iron too. It's not worth a ton, but this stuff is decent. Let's see, we'll we'll crank it up a little. Try not to get too many bad Yelp reviews though. Those are good. Those are good. Those are good. See? All good. Quick equip. Quick equip. Quick equip. Quick equip. Quick equip. All right, open the shop. Let's make some money. We've had to roll new characters because of those little bastards. Man, they are just... And like, for someone like me, that's my demise, right? Like, I'm going for loot, okay? If the loot is a trap, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. We'll make a, a decent amount from this. I can't, I didn't think I was gonna be able to, to get out of the dungeon. I don't know where I picked up gold. But I picked up enough to teleport myself out, and so I was gonna take it. It was not not a good run. 
Not a good run at all. See, when I know what the prices are and I don't have to do all the haggling and setting, I can just sell it beyond beyond about my way and yeah, everything's good. And see, it makes me want to be like, just one more, just one more dungeon. Just one more dungeon, one more dungeon. Close the shop, get out everyone. Very nice. And I still made like two grand for the day. It's really good. Mm-hmm. Hmm. All right. One more dungeon. If I can find the golem fight, I want to. Serious. I gotta get my controls down. Watch that when I miss that swing, it really affects you. Ooh. More potions. That's a good start to this run. Oh, God. Hey, don't steal. Don't steal. Don't steal. You're a bastard. Don't steal. They steal your loot. I don't like that. Oof. Come here. I don't know why it was crooked like that all of a sudden. They have to like punch or something. Oh my god, guys, let's just freaking try it. Let's just go. I got nothing to lose. Look, I mean, nothing really to lose. Nothing to speak of here with these guys are worth a lot more than those guys. Yeah, whatever. Let's go! Alright. I think I just pick, pick, pick away at him with the bow and don't get hit. Don't get hit. Do the angle. I gotta stop trying to do the angle. Oof, I'm sucking. Mm. No, that was such bullshit. I was not right here. Let's go! You feel that, boy? Let's go! First try, never die! What? This is one of the strange devices that the creature dropped when he fled. This one's rich, actually. Almost quite literally rich. 
For every time you place, for every item you place into this device, gold of some perceived value drops out. It's great if you need to use your pendant in a pinch. The device looks like a mirror, so I'm just gonna call it the mirror, keeping it simple. Where did the treasures drop inside go? Am I getting the best deal here? <laughs> I got a mirror, which lets me, oh my God, instantly liquefies items for gold to go home. Sweet. Now, do I start at level two every time I go in? Is that how it goes? I really would hope so. I'm scared. Oh, they are tough. I'm wondering if when I go in, if I go straight to level two, or if I have to go through level one every time like that. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. That looks new. Remains hidden while in the dungeon. Well, that's fun. Okay, those sort. Mm hmm. I don't know what those are. All things I need, apparently, though. I'm terrified. I got. I got, I got, I got not enough. So we gonna, we gonna evacuate. We also, we had a time, y'all. We had a time. We'll just have to find out next time. Okay. Oh wait, what? Oh no. Why did it have an X on it? I don't know. Hopefully not. I like how you just, you just pop out of a portal. Like, no big deal. Let's go put all our stuff in a chest. Quickly. <laughs> Quickly. Store it away. Mm-hmm. Mm. Not bad. Not a bad little haul. Um. Okay, if I sleep, does that make it... I want to do a save. I want to make sure... All right, y'all. Thank you so much for hanging out, spending some time with me, enjoying a new game, trying something out. This is great. Moonlighter, I give it like two like gamer thumbs up for sure because this is great. A perfect little mishmash of a lot of my favorite games with its own unique twist that I've never really experienced before with this like running the shop during the day and just playing with those mechanics and how that works and like I feel like I just started to scrape the surface and I love that it took me like you know about three hours to to beat the first the first dungeon the first level of the first dungeon like get your bearings that's a pretty good amount of time and I feel like I accomplished something in that time you know because I do think of a game if it doesn't hook you in the first couple hours it's probably not going to because that's probably all a person's gonna give the game right it's a long time it's a lot of it's a lot of time a lot of investment and I really I gotta say this one got me it was very good this is very fun um, I hope you guys enjoyed please remember to leave a like on the video if you didn't do that shout out to all of my members those of you who support each and every month and help keep the stream going and thriving and growing I couldn't do it without you guys we got lots of new members. Thank you for being here, new members. I uh, appreciate you guys. And those of you that are not members, please leave your comments uh, in the comment section. I love reading them. 
it's just you know I want you guys to feel part of the the community as well so um, so please you know let me know what you guys think let me know what you guys want me to play um, I want to keep cultivating what we got going on here because it really is great you know I'm very proud of what I have here my stream my community it's like my little cozy corner of the internet and I feel very protective of it but I, I do want to grow it and share with people so um, you know so do the same so remember Stay hydrated, have a nice stretch, prioritize your sleep, and enjoy the rest of your evening, most importantly. And I will see you guys next time. Thank you, as always, for watching.